Yeah, yeah. I'm a man of war. You don't want beef. I'll drop cannonballs. You'll be cannibalized like Anthony Hopkins in Amityville with the ideas of hell amplified. Red bandana tied around his satanic mind, dividing honest rhymes into two columns, knowledge to the right and the opposite on the opposite side. Too many intangibles left to analyze as I collect dollar signs to reside in Westworld where the Matrix and the Truman Show collide. Then, relish these embellished lies that devil calls lives, only a program intelligent extraterrestrials designed to be televised galaxy-wide. I just pearl another swisher with a bearded Clementine ever find a family guy who respect her well-developed mind and rewrite each chapter happily ever whatever it doesn't matter never mind I can provide well-defined double time vibrations when I'm combined in mind with my other side no slim shady persona it's more like my Sharona watch with caution often it's a coffin given to any whose writings are simplified like a broken-hearted organ donor or a paramedic suicide, I imply the contradiction, like I am the reason for rhyme. I've identified genocide in real time and recognized that Eminem and his La Familia are not friends of mine, they're all peculiar. So problems evolve from cauldrons to squadrons of monstrous goblins lost in this vanilla sky. I'll search for souls till my body dies, leaving messages expressed alive on my ticking time bomb in the DeLorean with four Nordic women. Killing time! Only Iron will survive, energized by normal mortal individuals whose moralities have materialized through subliminal systems by criminal minds. I've alphabetized and categorized affirmations from imaginations redefined by acclamations of divine fascination. This dark virus is Roman, like Pope Pius. America's paradise is like this at its core with more gore and violence. War, crisis, hordes of ISIS, unexplored science, a force to form for pure defiance on the front lines willing to die for your alliance. Retired tridents tried to warn of Poseidon silence. Reminds us of the importance of lightning bolts with the voltage heightened. Before we ignore enormous alignments, Hell Zeus, Set, Thoth, Shiva, Brahma, Ra, Allah, Yah, Odin, Baal, Jehovah, Gaia. Demonic hormones falling from foreign skies performed and bore tyrants like the sons of Guggenheim who utilized unhuman ties and bloodlines to divide the islands. Multiplied the means to seem above equal. Subtracted love amongst the people and added in an evil upside, which justified the brainless slaves they sacrificed in a temple for namesake to feed the snake his feeble needs of cerebral mind. Then, tied it to Mayan hieroglyphs and opened a time rift during a paradigm shift to slide between the lines. But he who eats will eventually be consumed by his own diet. The reason they seem surprised when the tale finds them is outlined in that Bible beside you, a guide used to find a decent price for each demise. We need to delegate. We seldom find a fact supplied implying macro, hard-headed, or micro-soft-sided. I decided to fight it. Now I build gates in the great divide to keep the hate outside. I'm exposing those who demonstrate sadistic needs on a new order of pizza pies. Notable code words. Wow, what a neat device. Covert means you indeed need disguise. The devil did it, the priest replies, and repeated this at least six times. It's my expertise to leave the rest in peace and see no rest unless I see the beast is exercised. Blessed are those with souls detected. As each inception sheds reflection and excels perception when the essence dies, even Jesus was rectified by a stone thrown at concubines too wise to be conquered by compromise. I conjured Christ and realized I revealed the way to the doorways for thought. I picked the locks, though I never thought doorways opened, open corridors lined with more doorways for more thought. Windows, robots, illustrate, zero sentiment, peel or scrape, bent or straight, for real or fake. You feel the strength I demonstrate. You witness the demolition men with real restraint. You got to earn heart. They'll turn around and suddenly see the intimidator. Minutes later, they're spun around. If life's a bitch, at least I've invented the proper way to manipulate her. While I race around until a stint with the infinite presented a straight, the crater descended in power break. Instantly, I resented it. Yet, Still repented and represented it, even defended it when enemies made an attempted ending. Then people from around the planet went from closed minded over time slowly to open handed. Remembered to build in granite, indebted their own bedevilment, buried within the sediment, beneath the settlement, accepted skeptical rhetoric we heavily take for granted, heavenly is relevant to the virgin who emerges celibate. How hard it must be to be so frail and delicate. How could the devil be raising hell? I mean, God damn it, he's a heaven sent. Why would a rebel rebel to unveil the development of Confederate fellowship exodus is expressed next to a southern skeleton, male and an Indian infant, and a prehistoric beak on the wings of a pelican? If it doesn't arrive unique with the mystique of a neon pink elephant, then you need to check the mail again, and again, and again, and again, and again, for this is hell I'm in, 
alienated for helping them. Celebrating the sin I sinned, I repent for all the ignorant shit I've did again and again and again and again. Amen. I intend to ascend in the end, presenting a contradictory compliment if they're not content and common sense does not exist, so condemn them with consequences for their incompetence. All of this is ominous, but all this is with thoughts of an anonymous novelist. Not your typical hippopotamus conglomerate. I offer another apocalyptic hypothesis. Not even God can topple the operatives who oscillate atop of an obelisk in the ambiance of godlessness. Thoughtless followers who copy the populace. I planned it like a botanist. Skills equivalent with the quill of Nostradamus, which stocked his pockets with profits. Call his Neil, calls his quadrains, contain monotonous models for economic politics, which he spearheads like Pontius. If anarchy is lawless, I am sorry for all of this. I'm hardly alarming an army when harming an archon's heart chakra via carotid artery. Regarding myself as an anarchist whose artistry harbors harmony, you're arguing with a hardening gargoyle when I explain heads leave here hard boil. Nothing but medical advantages branch from our soil. Only turmoil and hard toil for any so-called royal. I'll be exalted when they're exhausted from fossil fuel. I swear that's a serpent, not all a coil. Before I pop, I can open a can for olive oil. My light strikes like a Lakota Hayoka, coping with self-awareness and paranoia. Until I feel some real fulfillment, I still conceal the real I deal with. My brilliant discernment is concurrent, certainly currently preferring some real shit. I will hit. I'm still lit, resilient, feeling a little chameleon. Bewildered, but still revealing a miracle healing. Familiar the feeling within the pavilion beneath the sun and the ceiling. A till of the hundreds of abducted children. So hungry the villain, huffing and puffing, but nothing is coming from someone corrupting everything under the ceiling. Like the daughters of fathers at altars with offers of waters erupting, it bothers the watchers whose monikers are monitored when obstacles caught in the opticals were optimal to the commoners, assaulted the molecules, which demolished this module, the prodigal mockery started, God, you're cruel. We're obviously your property, like dollars in your economy, pawns each pawn to be a monopoly tool. Like scholars in Deuteronomy, it's got to be true. Copper in your anatomy had to be an anomaly, demonic lobotomy. If not, then you're probably new. I probably knew. Friends who leap on top of me are leaving here wobbly. We leaning on misleading deceitful teachings of cosmic astrology to lead your cerebral psychology. Elitists properly teach what we the people ought to be. No more the war for Gomorrah or Sodom is forgotten. Your allure is poor at best. I'm a source of more or less sort of restored mythology. Each quadrain is a metaphor for Somalian gynecology policy reinforced. The road less traveled and battered, barely any gravel. Of course, I use words as weapons, swords sent from the source, forged in crystal quartz. As usual, the musical influence I use as a muse is delusional and useless to listen to and get the view I weave. Hollow, we follow what we view is false. I gamble with a pegasus and have sex with Aphrodite. A mighty stare from a star when I came in pulling horse hair for the full eight. I've even scared the almighty. But I play with fire and ice you desire. Another sacrifice to damn God, Jesus Christ. Oh, hello, you demons of light who raise hell on the third strike to the right of midnight. I'll just stay true to me and myself. That's Jim and I. Good night. Why?